This is an egg, and to make this you need a chicken. There are different ways how farmers keep their chicken. They can let them walk around freely and see the sun, also known as the happy way. Or they press them into small cages and stack them in a barn without daylight. This is the sad way. And then there's this option in the middle, cage-free chicken. Here they still live in a barn, but without cages. So they can freely walk around. It sounds great, right? Well, this is how it looks. They live in this noisy room without daylight for their entire life. Stuffed with industrial food, so they will poop one egg a day. And they all get bored and start picking each other. Because, well, there's just nothing else to do. And if these little machines don't keep up the production speed, they are shredded into hot dogs. In case you wonder where they sell chicken hot dogs, right here. They really have a sad life and afterlife. But here's the thing, we don't like hot dogs. So we bought one of these chickens to give it the life it deserves. She was very scared when we first met her. She didn't like being touched. She lost most of her feathers and it looked like she came out of one of those cartoons. And to be honest it felt disgusting, like holding a warm bag of chicken meat. Overall she didn't really look like a healthy chicken. And we called her Frida and let her walk around, doing real chicken things. <laughs> and after a while she got him better. It was just amazing seeing her become a happy and healthy chicken. She even lost her fear of humans and followed us everywhere we went. And if she couldn't find us, nah, she would find us. always joining us when we worked in the garden or having breakfast and if we left the door open she would come in the house <laughs> she slowly became one of the sweetest animals we ever had until one sad day this happened an empty house we looked everywhere but nowhere to be found she was gone just like that we like to think she has her ultimate freedom now, gone into the wild.